Okay, today we're talking about lag shot. Now, this club's very flexible. It's heavy. I'm going to use a couple other terms here because it's what I want you to feel and it's what really helps me with these clubs. And it starts right with chipping or you can even do it with putting. So rather than talk about lag, we're going to talk about loading the shaft and pressuring the shaft. So when I talk pressure, if I did this, see that's pressure in the shaft. You see how the shaft bends? Okay, that's pressure. That could also be called loading. So I'm going back, when I start forward, what happens is the weight of the club going back loads the shaft. So what, what does load mean? Load means it does this to the shaft. When you watch really good tour players, every swing they make, especially if, the, if you slow a driver down or a longer, a longer club, when they get to the top, when they change directions, the shaft goes like this and it actually bends. That's called loading the shaft. But you want to start right here with chipping. So what I'm doing here is I'm going to set up and I'm going to just put a little pressure so I can feel what it feels like to pressure the shaft. And then I'm going to try to create that same pressure which makes the shaft load. So it makes it do this. And then once it does that, I'm going to maintain that pressure all the way through the ball. So I'm going to feel that. I'm going to make a swing where I feel that. And then I'm going to keep that pressure on the shaft all the way through the ball. I push here so I feel what it feels like, that pressure feels like in my right arm and right here. Then I'm gonna load the shaft to create that same feeling. Then I'm gonna hit the ball where I keep that pressure or that load all the way through the ball. Now, this is really critical that you understand and you feel that pressure and that load of the shaft. Because as the club gets longer and longer, you should always feel the pressure of the shaft in your hand and the loading or the force that goes into the club. So again, we push. And when I'm pushing, I'm also pushing myself, my impact, so I'm lining this arm up with that shaft. If you put it up here and you pushed on it to make the shaft bend, this arm would line up with it. So that's the pressure or the load you're trying to feel. Then you go, okay, pressure the shaft. Then I make a little practice swing and I feel right here in the transition how I load the shaft and I keep that pressure in my hand all the way through the ball. So it's more about what I call loading and maintaining pressure. Load and maintain pressure. And that's why this is so good is because it exaggerates that and you start with just chipping to get a feel for that.